Well, I don't know if it's in the pickle or in the bubble, but I can tell you this. There's been a big, big misunderstanding between uh, Bounty Killer and Lane. And I'd like to see if I can help clear this thing out, you know. To think that Lang and Supreme Promotions doesn't really respect this guy is a misunderstanding. Because Bounty Killer has the goods. I value Lang Lightning Bounty Killer to Trevor Burbick in his losing boat with Mike Tyson, Stone the Warlord. He vowed on Twitter that he would not be appearing at Jamworld. The threat undercuts the hyped clash between Bounty and Tommy Lee, prompting Joe Bogdanovich to try and mediate the quarrel. The bounty Killer uh, was signed in the beginning, and I hope that he uh, will honor his contract, and I hope that he can work this thing out with Lang, because I think there's really a serious misunderstanding that can be resolved. What's your interest in all of this? Well, you know, I'm a co-producer. Um, that means you're pumping in some cash. Yeah, and that means that the artists are going to get paid. <laughs> 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 I'm not sure that anyone thinks that they're not going to get paid. The buck stops here. <laughs> Okay. So much money you put together show this year? Millions. Millions. He keeps praise on Bounty, Lane, and Sting. His pitches, everybody loses if something can't be sorted out. I think it's a bump and I think that, um, I think it, I really do believe it'll be resolved. I think that, um, I just think that it's a misunderstanding. I think that there's a way to get around this thing so that nobody's disrespected. I don't think, um, I, I know that Lane doesn't want to disrespect Bounty Killer. And because he realizes, again, his importance. And I'm going to make a big effort to see if we can, you know, make this thing make sense to everybody. And more importantly is that, you know, there's very few stage shows left. Uh, there's a lot of restrictions. This is one of three of the biggest shows in Jamaica. And, you know, I think that we need to support, you know, everybody needs to support, you know, the business, you know, your, your platform. You know, I mean, the artists, you know, the patrons, the sponsors. You gotta, you know, you gotta support reggae and dance hall music. And Sting is, you know, the best at what it does, and it's all over the world. So I just think we gotta step back a little bit and get our senses and try to work on the same thing, get rid of the crabs in the barrel, get into this more productive state of mind. Will Bounty relent? Can Leng learn humility? Is Joe the man to make peace? More questions than answers right now. With this man's game, something's sure to give. Sting regular Kiprich has heard the talk about bounty killers staying full out. No, when killer still in them, killer not over one for the world. Really, really still in them. We know that about bounty killers. See, I don't know what the thing is, I'm on it. Things I'm on with a stock in mind and them things they do and them business, see. So, I know if Ling will look back in himself and, you know, make an apology or something and bunch will accept it. Well, it's another good for the show, you get to me and say. If there's no warlord, does Kipperich see himself taking on Tommy? Not really, it seems, because he's focused on shows before and after staying. Whatever the advertised this year was the whole Tommy Lee and Bounty Killer thing. So that was the highlight of the show. It was a key bridge and Tommy Lee. So things have changed. So things have changed now. It, it changed now. No, when we did all the arrangements. Many have made an arrangement because at that minute, they had the hype of the whole thing. But money moves more and still enough. Isn't that what So, anything possible on that level there. Like the news that Bogdanovich is bankrolling staying this year. It's out there, yeah, most of the time, them when the man them go over there, the food are really run, <laughs> out to run, and you get peace and cookies. So, you know what I mean? You don't know that thing, that thing they're out there. So, we have to face that reality there. So, with a man like Joe and Bone, they know say, yo, this man has paid bills. So, what would filling in for Bone sound like? The young man, when I leave that to Jammer, but they'd quit them way the man. Right now, I eat line of fire already. Watch out. See, 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 see,
We did that interview on Tuesday. Next day, Isaiah Lang got the surprise of his life when Guess Who shows up at his office with Joe Bogdanovich. Yes, the same guy who just a week before said no amount of money would ever make him do sting again. I wonder what changed his mind. Wednesday. Good afternoon. I'm me name Sting. I don't know about the name, sir. You remember that, yeah? Nobody where you push up. I don't push them, push me up with Sting. I may create that. I will not work Sting as long as I live. Where can I tell you people and say, bro? I'm telling you. All right. Where can I tell you? All right. You know what I say? All right. You know what I say? 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 You see that box, the front page. <laughs> you know, appreciate that box. You know, the and it means we get some money. We have to eat. I'm not to eat that TV. You can't even get the money. I'm going to have to find it. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? What? You know and I know, me are the hunger and ruly picnic come in this year camp. Me are the hunger and ruly artist in the music industry. We cannot take me. We not put away. I'm sorry. No, Joe Bogdanovich clearly not about to throw money at a non-mention man still. But what about Bounty? Are bundles of cash about to drop his way to? Stay tuned. Is there money I say we get it name? Back up my turn up now.